Are we rolling? Are we rolling? All right, we're rolling, people. At what point in time did you realize that you had been forgiven of all of your sins? I've known about, like, being forgiven. I've known about what Jesus has done for me, but it wasn't real for me for most of my life. I'd say um, within the past couple of years, it's been the reality of me actually being forgiven of my sin has been, like, solidified and for me to come to know that it's a reality within the past couple of years. Um, it's just been that reality has been growing. Um, <clears throat> but there's a verse in it's Psalm, Psalm 103, and it says, He's not dealt with us according to our sins, uh, nor pay, repaid us according to our iniquities. And that verse has been something that's really um, helped solidify the reality that I've been forgiven because sin is like sin has been dealt with on the cross. And so mm. when God deals with me, he doesn't deal with me according to sin. He deals with me according to righteousness yeah. because it's been, righteousness has been Im- imputed to me. So I always remember that, and that's what keeps me, even if I do mess up, if I mess up, you know, not when I do, if I do. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. Amen. Yes, that's sir. That's really profound. Okay, so when I got saved in 2014, like, I, like, surface level believed that, like, I was forgive, forgave of all my sins because, like, that's what everybody says, right? Yeah. When you get saved, like, you're forgave of your sins. But I wouldn't say that I actually, like, knew that and understood that until I came to LCU and, like, learning, like, the, the purification of the bride and realizing, like, that I literally am clean and that I'm pure, like, because of his blood and because of what Jesus did, that, like, he sees me and I'm not dirty and my sin is, like, thrown into the sea of forgiveness forgetfulness so i say that's when i really knew that i was forgave my sins wow amen well for me um i was raised in the church so we we always went to church but at at a certain point my eyes were kind of opened by funnily enough my sunday school teacher Mm. um i think it was on a wednesday night and he was just talking to the class about what jesus's blood has done and how it's been poured out and it completely covers us and he explained that if he forgave us for what we just did just now 2000 years ago then how could he not have also forgiven everything we would also do and it was really powerful because he he kind of made me realize that everything that I've ever done in the past everything that I've just done now and everything that I will do he already saw that he mm-hmm. already looked at me, he viewed the things that I, that I would do, and he already forgave me. He, he loved me so much that he would just wash it all away. And, um, yeah, that's what I realized. I'd say for me it was kind of a process because I did grow up in religion and works mentality. Mm. Um, I would say I got, like, a revelation of it last year, like being a first-year student. Him just coming and giving me the revelation of, like, I am fully free and forgiven. Like, when I come and I repent and confess. And it was just, like, then, in that moment, he gave me a revelation of just who he is and his character of love. And that I'm loved. And that I don't have to do anything to earn it. And so, yeah, like, last year, he just hit me with it of, like, there's nothing you could ever do to receive this like free gift of being fully um, forgiven. It's just what I did. It's finished. Like it's done. Just receive it. Um, so yeah, it kind of gave me like eyes to see that I'm his treasure. Like he's the merchant searching for the treasure, and he found it. And I just have to receive it and believe it. That's a good question. Um, for me, and I'm gonna be pretty vulnerable about it. Um, I grew up in the church and everything, so I dealt with, like, a lot of religion and stuff. And, like, of course, right away I didn't get, like, you know, still dealing with sin and stuff. But I think for me, that moment, um, I heard his voice tell him he loves me, like, when I was actually in sin, like, in the midst of it. Wow. And I think at that moment is when I knew, like, no matter what, like, I did, like, he's not condoning what I'm doing, but the fact that he loves me and he doesn't see my sin, but he sees me, that's when I knew that I was forgiven. 